side action, and we're just about set to kick off. And now we bring you the coin toss, and it's presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Both teams are lining up for the kickoff, and we're just about set to get this one underway. He's out to the 30. He makes it to the 32-yard line. The Panthers have shown over the course of the season that they want to get this guy the football, but you can't just go to him every play. Well, on the road, you especially want to take the crowd out of the game, and the one guy you know who can do it is this wide receiver. The problem you have is this defense, more often than not, is going to be aligned to take him out of the game. And that, to your point, Brad, that's where somebody's going to have to step up, whether it's the running game, some of the other receivers. You're going to have to take some of the pressure off of him and really make it a team effort to be able to win this game on the road. Second down and five. Ball on their own 37. Tailback brought down for a loss. A loss on that one as he couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed it. Fakes to the back. He heaves it deep. Down the sideline. Nobody covering the tight end, and he's got it. And that's the way you're supposed to play pitch and catch. Absolutely. You know, this wide receiver is a difference maker. He's one of those players that has a chance to go the distance every time you get him the ball. And the big pickup through the air has made it first and ten. made right around the eight-yard line. And he gets the touchdown. run by the halfback to find the end zone. Good play call here by the offense coordinator. He realizes when you get down into the red zone and you have a halfback like this, just give him the ball and let him find his way into the end zone. He makes the PAT. A five-play, 68-yard drive, and it's good for seven points. Brad, that's one of those drives that can just tear your heart up. They can really demoralize a defense when they drive the ball down the field, and a lot of the yards came on the ground. So our score, 7 nothing, gets to about the 34-yard line. So here comes the offense taking the field for the first time today. Gets to around the 42. Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. He's tackled at the 43. him hard at the 46 yard line that's not everyday speed you're talking about with this guy this is a unique burst combined with a really impressive field vision first and ten ball on the 46 play fake and he can't get away from the pressure
So another third down here, and this time it's third and long. They're going to be forced to punt it away here. The offense really had nowhere to go on that one. The play was very well defended, and now the incompletion will force the fourth down and a punt. He's taken down at the 30. This offense threw the ball extremely well on their last drive, and they ended up with a touchdown. I love to watch a quarterback when he can really get into sync with his wide receivers. These guys have worked all week on their preparation to attack this defense, and right now it's really paying off. Makes it to the 41. They go with the option and pick up the first down. Yeah, and that was a situation where the quarterback knew he could pick up the first down if he kept it himself. That's a good decision. First and 10. Ball on the 41. They bring him down in the backfield. and his receiver make a great play here and convert on an early down. They're about four yards away here on third down. Find his halfback, first down. Nice run up the middle. That makes it second and six. It's second and six. Ball on the forty two. That's a That makes it first and ten. Four down, four down. Mike, four. They'll get him for a loss. From the 34-yard line, it's second down. They come out in a five-wide set. hit before he can go anywhere after one quarter of play and we've got a low scoring defensive battle on our hands seven nothing panther and we're back for more action here in quarter number two convert here on another third down the sub package in there defensively in this five wide receiver set fires out to his wide out and he's taken down at the 13 you know this is just amazing you spend six days planning as a defensive coordinator for one guy and then you get the other quarterback so now what happens
Makes it to the 12-yard line. So they turn it over on downs, and that's a big boost for this defense. In a close game like this one, it's big plays like this that can be the deciding factor. There hasn't been too much daylight between these two teams. In games like this, some players try to press too much, and that can cause mistakes. Makes it to the 24. First down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 24-yard line. They'll bring him down for a loss on the play. Well, that's just a good call from the defensive side of the football. They know what this team likes to run, and they got the better of them that time. Seven yard line. It's third down. Throws it deep. That close to being intercepted. It can be tough making a play on the ball sometimes, but that's probably a pick he should have made. That brings us fourth and seven. this close you can't afford to waste possessions he's taken down right around the 46 yard line that makes it second and two it's second down and they're about two yards away from the sticks the middle for a nice game. That makes it first and ten. They'll run it. Gains his way to the 39-yard line. That brings us second and nine. It's second down now, and they're just a few feet away from that first down marker. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five-wide outlook. And he's tackled at about the 43-yard line. In a perfect world, he knocks this kick down inside the 10. one goes into the end zone and that'll be a touchback momentum swings have been fairly even and with so little separation this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays zips it to the tight end 
And they make the stop around the 32-yard line. I'm really liking what I see from this guy. He's not afraid to go to the air on any down. From their own 32-yard line, it's first down. Looks middle, got his back. Fumble! Defense has it. It's one of the corners. They work hard, and they got the turnover. Well, this is what it's all about. Defense taking advantage of an opportunity. They're pouncing on the loose ball. In a game that's this close, you can't afford to waste possessions. Over the middle to his tailback. Maybe a yard that time on the screen. The offense is trying to get the ball into the hands of the halfback here, and he did a pretty good job of getting a few yards, but the defense was just swarming to the ball right there. Throws it into coverage, and it's intercepted. Brought down at the 32, and that was just an outstanding pick. Great play by the defender to high point the ball, but the quarterback wasn't in rhythm on the throw. First down, 10 to go. Ball on the 32. Quick strike to the receiver. And down he goes, right around the 14-yard line. The Tigers use their second timeout. Got it. And he goes down quickly. with that tackle. And he didn't have much of a chance on that play. Boy, this defense has a lot of speed. They're all over him by the time he caught the ball. So they decide to bring the kicker out to try to get three points before the half ends. And he's got it. They're probably just going to squib this kick. I don't think they want to see the return man create lightning before halftime. Tight first half of football, and we head to the break. The Panthers lead it by four. Very close game now as we start the second half. Gets to about the 27-yard line. I think this defense has played well enough to be able to win this game, obviously. But at some point, you'd love to see their own offense feed off of some of the confidence that their defense is playing with, because up to this point, the defense is keeping them in the game, but the offense isn't quite doing enough to be able to build on that lead. They hand it off. Tackled after a decent pickup. It's second down, six yards to go. Ball on their own 31. He's tackled at the 41. It's going to be interesting to see how the action shakes out in this series. Nice 
nice run there. That's a gain of six on the play. That'll make it second. They're about four yards away here on second down. There's a play fake. Fires it out to the 10. What a play, and that'll set up a first and goal. Right now, this quarterback, when he's calling play action, is doing a good job of selling the run fake. He's not tipping his hand at all that it's a play action pass. He's doing a good job of selling the run fake, which is getting the defense out of position and making it much easier to throw the football. First down, and they've got their eyes on that goal line. He's in there. Touchdown. He really plowed his way into the end zone there. Great looking touchdown. Once you get inside the 10 yard line, this halfback is automatic. And he tacks on the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. At the 36. The last time this offense had the ball, it was three and out. If they're going to make a comeback in this game, it's going to have to start now. This offense has to get rolling. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. He gets it out to about the 47-yard line. So it's second down now, and they need about four yards to pick up the first. They come out on an empty backfield. Tackle at the 45-yard line. He wasn't decisive at all on that option. Once he kept it himself, there was no place to go. it all going deep and this one's going to get intercepted well he was facing a big pass rush the ball had no chance of being caught by one of his teammates that's what pressure will do for any defense first down got to be careful down here deep in your own territory Tackled just outside the goal line. The penetration by the defense was so good on that play that it didn't matter who the ball carrier was. Anyone would have been brought down for a loss. He's to the 10. Tackle made right around the 12 yard line. They need about three yards to get the first down here on third down. Takes it in his tackle short. He 
just got drilled. The offense comes out to start this drive, and they're hoping for a better result as they threw a pick on their last possession. This quarterback can make good passes. He just needs to focus on not forcing the ball to his receivers. On the ground with a tailback. And they get nice yardage on that run. From the 37-yard line, second down. Bring him down at the 34-yard line. Takes the toss left. He gets out to about the 32-yard line. So at the end of the third quarter, the Panthers lead 14-3. Welcome back to the action here as we resume play here in quarter number four. Gets out to about the 31. Second down, eight to go. Ball on the 31. And he's taken down at the 30-yard line. to make sure they got him before he got to the marker. Looks like they're going to go for it on fourth down. Makes his way out to about the 15. This is the eighth play of this drive. to about the five. So it's second down, and they're only about a foot away from picking up the first down. Joseph moves, and he's in. Took it in for six. Simple play call there by the offensive coordinator. Just give it to the back and let him find his way into the end zone. So the offense is going to go for two. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. And they won't get the two. This one away. Excellent kick. Let's see what they can do on offense as they take possession after the return. I think it's pretty obvious they've got to keep the ball on the ground here. Take as much time off the clock as possible. And he throws it away. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 25-yard line. Halfback's got it on the quick throw. He's taken down at about the 29-yard line. Number 20 on the tackle at the 29-yard line. That'll bring up third and six. 
Now it's third and six coming up. All in the 29. And he makes it out to about the 31-yard line. He gains a couple of yards on the carry. That's a big stop there. So when they get the ball back, there will be no need to rush. They know they've got to put the ball in the end zone, but they've got enough time that they don't need to hurry things up too much. Less than three minutes in the game. He makes it out to maybe the 39-yard line. Both teams realize that when the ball is snapped, we're one play away from a very different ball game. There are five wide receivers split out. The quarterback in the gun. They pick up a good six yards there. The slant is so hard to defend when the pass is right on the money. But at least the defense was there to keep it from turning into a bigger play. Need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Well, the defense has to be very frustrated there. They did everything. They got to the quarterback. In fact, it looked like they had a chance to bring him down for the sack, but somehow he's able to throw the ball away. Back up quarterback into the game now to call the signals. He's hit immediately. From their own 49-yard line. First down. And he just gets rid of it. Just over a minute left. Throws complete and he stopped immediately. That's four yards on the play. Here the defense is sitting in man-to-man -man coverage. The quarterback saw the receiver get a small opening. And he's able to deliver the ball for a nice game. Third down now, and they need to get it inside the 41. Caught over the middle. Well, a lot of frustration by that offense, but you've got to give the defense credit for coming up with a stop in this quarter in a game this close. And if they don't convert here, then the game is over. Fires quick. He's got another one. And he is drilled at the 26. The Tigers call a timeout. That's their second of the half. And this play is number eight on the drive. Just throws this one away. From the 26-yard line. Second down. He gets rid of this one. They tried to fool him by running the same play again. Well, fooled no one there, Brad. And this is the 10th play of the drive. Going for it all to the end zone. Oh, and he can't hold on. And once again, the coaches decided to go for it on fourth down. This is their last chance. They need a big play here. He steps up. Deep pass to the end zone. He came down with it. Touchdown.
The kicker will stay on the sidelines for this extra point as the offense is going to stay on the field and try to make this a three-point game. Little stumbles like these can kill your offensive progress. You don't really gain anything by kicking the extra point here, so they'll go for two and try to go up by three. There's a strike complete. They don't get it. like they're ready for the kick he kicks it off and he got all of that one and they can forget about returning this one the Panthers have sort of set up the defense with this wide receiver doing most of the damage do they go away from him or do they do something different I think one of two things here for this offense you either find a way to get your star receiver the football or in some cases you want to use him as a decoy maybe take two or three defenders with him and then open it up for somebody else to be able to make a play Gets it out to his receiver in a hurry. And they finally knock him out at the 27. And he tackles him hard at the 30. Now oh, that is a big hit on the quarterback. That's one of those as an offensive lineman, when the film study starts to come around, you're going to kind of sink in your chair and just hope they don't call you out because you're going to get embarrassed on Monday. Right? And they make the stop at about the 11. The Panthers will use their first time out of the half. First and 10, all on the 11. The Panthers are going to call their second timeout. Picked up a yard of anything on that run. The kick is up, and he got it! Game over! Man, that is as big as it gets. He had the whole game on his shoulders, and he was perfect. You really feel great for a guy when he's able to come through like this. Everyone's all lined up and ready for the kickoff. And he got all of this one. Great kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Well, this is the chance. Late in the fourth quarter, they're behind, but they've got an opportunity now to come back and win it. One last play, folks. It's time to find out how far he can throw it and see if this game becomes one of the all-time greatest. Here we go. This one will fall incomplete. The Panthers coaching staff, Kirk, do they start wondering, hey, uh, are we going to have trouble with our star player after the struggles he had today? Well, I think the coaching staff's got to be happy that this team was able to win the football game and overcome the fact that their star player didn't have a great game. But I think making adjustments and changing the game plan because their star didn't deliver, I think that would be a big mistake. For EA Sports and Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.